Hey Legionnaires and welcome back, we're here with another part of our Seljuk campaign for 1212 AD and it will probably be the last part of our Seljuk campaign um, since we are only two settlements away from completing our mission of making the Seljuk Empire and we have well one, two settlements right here with uh, Venice controlling both and I have armies surrounding ready to assault both this army will be ready to attack uh, Scopi along with this one next turn and we will uh, be able to besiege them and we'll probably be taking uh, this element here, Stradets, I'm going to say how you say it, um, next turn. And uh, we will be then uh, an empire. And I am so like consolidating these places. These places like are actually becoming happy now. And that's really good. I'm glad that they are. Like I thought it was going to take forever to consolidate these places. But you know what? It actually doesn't take too long. Um, over in the east, you can see that, uh, well, the Crusaders are doing uh, quite a lot of work, actually. Antioch especially is uh, retaking... A lot of land and I guess they're going for like an outer rim sort of empire. But uh yeah, it's good to see that they are they're doing stuff. So I'm gonna probably end the turn here and I am going to uh well obviously see what happens in this end turn. I imagine Venice will try and relieve the siege to some extent. If they do, well that's fine, we'll have a big old battle. If not, then uh well we're not having a big battle. Put it like that. Um but yeah, I will probably do like, oh, is this guy going to come and try and assassinate one of my leaders? I will probably do a battle in this one. I've done, a, there has been a lack of battles in this one. And like, I do apologize for that. That's just kind of like sometimes how it goes. Oh, that guy is definitely very much available to attack. So we'll do that next These turn. Beasts, uh, Silesia, no, I will not join your war. So we have a battle definitely going to happen this turn because I've seen a prime target to deal with both an army and also the garrison of the army. Um, so we'll probably be doing that. And uh, I cannot wait to see what happens. But if you've been enjoying seeing this campaign, I know it's coming to an end now. Uh, do remember to leave a like, subscribe if you're around here. Yeah, he did. He got assassinated. What a, what a rude guy. Success. Oh, he dangerously came close. Well, that's still not nice. Now we've got some guy that's a drunkard in charge of my army. Um, so we'll deal with that. Uh, just do... A small bribe there we go but yeah if you've been enjoying seeing this campaign like i said do remember to leave a like subscribe if you're around here and a comment to show your support as always guys um uh, like your support like keep these uh these let's plays going and i know like i said this one's coming to an end but i will be doing some more in the future as uh, we take that siege out we'll do that settlement's been and gone lost 200 men we'll occupy the city and then we can move this army on to like here Actually, can we just do that? Oh, we can just occupy it? What? Okay, so technically we've completed the mission, but because that would be an incredibly uh, slow, uh, a very short campaign, I am going to bring this army. Let's just, can I get you outside the city? Yeah, I can. All right. Let's put you in there. And then bring this chap up. Well, let me upgrade this guy first. Um, you can then have authority. You can then have integrity for your army. Uh, and then we attack this Venetian army here. Will he retreat? I don't think he can. He can retreat. Didn't know if he could in a... Uh, in a... Uh, in a fort. But anyway, we're going to attack him now and we'll have a battle. And there you go. Look, I mean, this is a pretty depleted army, but I know... And I'm pr kind of going over the top with the amount of troops here, but heck, we will have a battle anyway, because I know you guys uh, enjoy seeing um, battles. And we, had, like I said, this Let's Play has not had many battles, so we'll, f um, we'll certainly have one in the final part. But yeah, we've already completed in like the first two minutes the mission. So I guess I'll see uh, how far I can get in like this today's episode, obviously. I won't cut it short just for that. We'll keep a normal length episode um, and we'll see like if we can take any more fortresses, any more stuff. Um, I doubt it. Um, I don't think I'm like really in any open wars with anyone. I mean, I could go to war with uh, Serbia, I guess. Serbia is like getting out of control. They've literally got like some sort of snake going around like the entire uh, Black Sea. Really, they are li they are into uh, Armenia and Azerbaijan, that part of the world, by looping around the top. There we go, dry. Um, I imagine, yeah, I will have to attack. He is over there. That's fine. We have got a uh, our horse archers here. I'm actually just going to be honest. I'm not that bothered about my setup because I have got reinforcements on the way. Yeah, this is just a lot of spears here. You just all line up like so. General, go.
go in there. And we're kind of good to go. I mean, apparently I should win with just this. Uh, I have an army that is going to be appearing behind the enemy, so let's just push you way up. Yep. Yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah, look at this. I've got carry. Is this the army? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think this is the army with which is just taking this, yeah, just taking the other city. So it's got a lot of, uh, a lot of spears, put it like that. And these are all spears from all my, oh my gosh, I'm going to have such a huge army here. I will not need all of this. I might just leave some at the back. I'll just work with these two armies. But we will see what we can do, right? So just put the spears up here. What have we got? We've got Cav. Oh my gosh, this is just so messy. Um, you go like so, go on this side. What else we got here? We've got archers. You're all be part of the same archers. So you can go like somewhere like there. I think, uh, yeah, go like there. And then what else we got? That's kind of it actually. You're also part of this force. Can you also come to like here? Thank you. I bet they're already very confused. Like, oh my gosh, there is enemies everywhere. I guess just come up to here, but you're not going to make it in time. And that's not even all the army. I'm pretty sure there's more still to come. Uh, what's this? This is, oh, this is the general. Just stay back there. Even though if you like, yep, you've just arrived. You need to get a move on. Look at this. The AI is just like, what the heck do I do? Ugo is probably like, I am, I'm dead here. I'm a dead man. And he is. This army's not getting out of here alive, as far as I'm aware. Uh, yeah, you've got a little way to come yet. Like, look at this. <laughs> what is going on here? Um, I'm probably actually going to probably be aggressive with this army first, and then the original army that I had can, uh, can be a bit more passive. Mainly because they got all their archers out the front. Or what was the front? It's now the rear. Look at this. They're all so confused. If I have one artillery piece just to throw in there, I could just throw some nice rocks. I mean, I could be aggressive with this cab actually as well. Um, my shot cab on this side is terrible though. It's not good at all. And they're not setting up at all. So, I mean, can't really just charge in. This is just a massive infantry. I need my archers to get up so I can start uh, skirmishing stuff. And yeah, are we firing? Yeah, they're firing. My guys are firing on them, which is perfectly fine. Crossbows, can you come over here? This is all my crossbows. And then let's just keep penning them in. This is looking <laughs> perfect. This is like just death for them. Oh, archers, get back. They're just going to charge. They're straight up just going to charge, aren't they? Uh, can you skirmish mode on? Just so I don't... I've got a little less micro to do. Glorious music going on in the background as my uh, cavalry comes charging on forward. Uh, I guess all the cavalry can come up from this uh, spare army that I have. Oh, well, there's the general. <laughs> Let's go and kill him. Uh, cavalry, get back. Get back. And what's this? This is my other cavalry. Go in here and kill him. Get out, get out, get out. Come on. Move on. These guys are gold chevron. I've just realized. Jeez, these are elites. I and mean, they must be part of like the original army or something like that. And you just get out of here as well. Come on. Uh, yeah, this general is probably in a bad state of affair right now. And all this cavalry just get a move on. Uh, spears, I guess, move up, but I'm not really going to need you. There you go. You go like so. Spears come this way. And then the general come through the middle. This cavalry is in a real bad state. This is mounted sergeants. Oh, can't lose my, be my beautiful mounted sergeants. Um, cavalry come this way. There you go, the general's gone. Need to get these guys out of here, really. But hey, and you get out of here. You go around there. You come in here. Oh, you're a horse archer, I forget. And, yep, yeah, they're all breaking. Enemy units have been rallied. I think the general's rallied, but that's fine. Yeah, he's rallied. Can we just shoot him down? 
men are broken and running for their lives. Yeah, that's my mountain sergeant's gone. I'm not too fussed about that. That was going to happen Their anyway. General Their general's dead, and this is going to be a, an easy victory, really. I mean, they were a half-starved uh, like army as it was, and it's also just a very simple spear spam, really. There's a few like swords in here, but I mean, I don't know. Italian like armies just aren't suited for the land battles, I find. Certainly not against uh, Arabs, we'll put it like that. Oh, are you still all running away? Oh, you might as well just charge these guys at this point. And there we go, that's it. That's that's the battle. That was a very quick and decisive victory. I think the worst unit that came out on like came out was uh, my mountain sergeants here. Yeah, none of these guys got any kills. All my other armies uh, were the ones that got kills. Um But uh yeah, that was I mean that was nice a nice easy victory there for Murad. Uh, Ugo is very much dead now on the battlefield. I think this entire army should uh, should die because he's retreated once. Crusaders of the Eternal City. Why are you crusading for Rome? That's the question I want to know. And there we go. An easy victory, really, in the end. Uh, I'll I'll take those uh, extra troops. I guess the yeah the sergeants came out alive. That's the main worry. It wasn't even a worry. Oh, he's somehow what? He's got out. Okay, right. Well, um, can we just turn the map around? I don't really like it at this angle. Oh, I've gone a long way around. I really have. Oh, that's a cut. Yeah, I went a long way. Uh, is it like that? No, it's more like that. But yeah, I know you're flashing at me. I can now found the empire, so I'll, I'll do that. There we go. Founding of an empire. The Seljuk Empire. Your faction's rank has increased to empire rank. Donating the status of your faction has a great power. Um... Oh, well, it's denoting, I think that means. Does that mean I have, um, like, less Imperium or something now? No. Don't think so. Uh, Sunny Islam is on the uh, on the increase. It's good to see. Uh, can we just send, like, one of the armies out to just hunt this man down and kill him? We can. Uh, I will just now also resolve this time. The challenge of killing Ugo is uh, long gone. There we go. Now Venice has no longer got any armies in the region. They'll probably want to make peace with people. Oh no, why did I do that? Uh, go down there and then integrity, please. And then you, Murad can. Oh, he's gotten like no, no things. Uh, you can have, where's the sword? Decorated sword, have that. Uh, and you can have authority, have that. And then you can have authority and then zeal. There you go. Look at all the armies I've just littered around here now. Uh, I'm going to probably destroy a lot of this. Um, we will put in... Yeah, sure, put in that. What's this? A water mill? Can we convert to an artisan? No. I'm going to need to make that into like a mosque or something. Um, destroy that. Uh, Catholic Priory? No, I'm going to have to destroy most of this, I think. I will repair that, though. Destroy, destroy, and Spirit Maker. Destroy that as well, I think. And then, yeah, we should be able to basically make, uh, recoup most of our, uh, well, we'll have a lot of money basically going into our next turn. Can I build anything? I can build something here. Uh, food is actually down. Why are you so unhappy? Food is minus one. And religious differences is a major issue. But, as you can, oh, Sunny Islam's actually going up. Well, we can't have that happening. Um, but I can't put in another mosque because you're only allowed one region apparently in this world i'm gonna put in a uh in some like network basically keep it ha uh healthy constantinople could do with it as you can see disease is a a major issue and uh yeah i'm probably gonna well i'll see what diplomacy is looking like last empire really liked me um they are allies of republic of venice and they probably don't like that that i'm at war with venice no Venice probably would make you peace. Yep. Can I make them break their alliance, though? Welcome, um, welcome, my friend. No. I yeah, I can. Yeah, break military alliance the with world. these guys. No, they're really good terms with them. This is annoying. Um, what else can we go to war over? Oh, they actually took Aleppo to Antioch. Well done, them. I don't know. These guys are obviously going to really Hail. like me. As requested, can I make them I a vassal? No. Could I make Nicaea a vassal? I, I mean, I've kept these guys alive long enough. Like, I've just... These poor men are just, like, being left in the center of my empire. Just, like, ready to, like, be killed off at some point. And I've just not done it. What? Why does Pisa have Westerphalia? 
That's an interesting one. I won't. I won't lie. Um, these guys no longer city. Okay. We are as Trade. Always, a welcoming no. host to you. How much you'd? Oh, that's. It's not as much as I thought. Arrange truth. marriage. Okay. Um. Well. There's nothing there available. Can I get any like wives or something Please off you? Be seated. No, probably not. I don't really need the money Welcome. or needs like anything. Your I'm just kind of looking around, seeing what's going on. Uh, right. We'll just end the turn, I guess. Who could we go for next uh, to try and make it interesting for the last like 15 or so minutes? Do you think? I don't know. We could probably we could maybe make an assault onto Hungary and into Serbia. Serbia's not defending any of these cities. And, uh, I mean, Serbia's got lands over here, and I only have to defend these two. But and I imagine that they have armies ready for them. Hmm. Okay, right. Where's that small army that I have that's, like, ling Yeah, it's this army. Oh, you're doing stuff at the moment. I really want to take your Grawl Ghulams out of that army. That's just such a waste having you there. Um, so I'm going to probably just move this army, move up to Kaffa... This army is going to move back around to uh, Batar and Katesh just to like bulk up some garrisons. So Kaf is going to take a little hit for a moment, but that's fine. It's got a garrison. Why are you so unhappy? Yeah, religious differences, which is just such a major issue in this part of the world. Uh, I could do with a mosque in there as well. I've got to just do some stuff over here first. And you can have a Zerna, because why not? And you can have... Builder, and you can have taxes. There you go. And you can have various things, it would seem. Look at this. And you can have converting targets. Why not? Snopes just looking so happy. Everywhere is, though, in the center of my empire. It's looking gr glorious. I'm really enjoying... I've been, I've been enjoying this campaign. It's a tough one as the Seljuk Turks. I won't lie, because it's... Um, I honestly think that... And someone suggested it, it's, which is probably a much, much better idea is to uh, convert to Orthodox Christianity because then you can, uh, well, obviously, like, you don't have that issue with your, uh, like, happiness, basically, because you're, all the lands you're probably invading are probably Orthodox Christianity, but the ones, obviously, to maybe to the south, um, if you go after the Ayyubids, if you become strong enough to go for them, or even, like, the ones that are, like, even if you go for, like, the Holy Land, Holy Land's also, like, major uh, Sunny like population more than it is Christian. Uh, he's failed to assassinate my guy. I'm glad. Be at war with the Kingdom of Serbia. Well, it... Oh. No, the time it elapsed. Damn. I was literally about to do that. Uh, how this place has grown, I have no idea, but it is... Uh, it's grown. There, I guess you can have a plaza. You've needed one of those for a long time. Um, you can be converted into a... Wall City, I guess. You can convert to a mosque. You can convert to a camel. You can convert to not into a Jewish dive. Or are these all just... Oh. Well, they're all getting knocked down. Um, You can convert to a Wall City. And you can have a... I can't give you a mosque. That's a shame. But I can give you a town barracks. That will help with uh, public order. Right, and then, like I said, this army takes the Gulabs, and then they force march all the way over to Kaffa. Uh, it's going to take a lot of turns. Can I just go, yeah, I was going to say, can I just go like that way into the sea, and then I should get to Kaffa in one, it's going to be like two turns, I think. Isn't it? Yeah, it's going to be like two turns to get there. Do that. And then you, sirs, we fight for you, my well, I've got two armies, which is the better of the... I mean, this is the most elite one. What's this one got? Oh my gosh, yeah, I've got a couple of choices here. Um, I'm going to put you... No. You can attack, declare war. Hungary will join, obviously. Um, which is just a shame for them. I think, actually, I don't know if Hungary did join. They did, I think. I just saw it turn red. Which is fine. I would... Uh, be quite happy with them joining the war and then we send these guys on as well and they can just go like up here and there's no way they would take they're going to come out and take this from me and then this guy just goes into stradets or whatever and it goes plus two for like a few turns this place is going to rebel but that's fine i've got a i've got an army that just kind of watches over both 
I mean, this place actually is undefended for like two turns while we get like a small garrison going. Um, but yeah, and then I, I guess we can just like end the turn, maybe like take one of the cities and then we this probably wrap up the episode pretty soon. Oh yeah, I forgot to move this guy. Yeah, I actually probably wanted to move him onto Katasia, but I don't know where Serbia's armies are. They have armies literally everywhere. They could probably threaten most of my cities. Oh, look at that. Who had that region, I just realized? Like, Venice, we were attacking someone that I was allied, allied to. This guy's also just terrible at trying to assassinate. Can we just murder him yet? I could do with probably getting a uh, assassin. Hungary? I probably should actually try to make peace with Hungary. Um, but we're going to take all the Serbian lands. I imagine Serbia can't afford a massive army because, like, the lands they've taken cannot be prosperous. Um, they are, like, around the Black the Black Sea region. And, like, not where I would have thought, like, wealth and power and stuff is. Um, assassinate. Okay, yeah, you're going to rebel. Um, right, so... Yeah, who am I allied? Who was, like, Venice moving into towards and attacking? Was it... I have no idea. Oh! When did you get an army here? I think they sieged it down. Weren't you? You have spent a long, long time getting an army over there, sir. But yeah, I am basically would now be going into a lot of central... Look at, like, how far Turkey... Oh, uh, Turkey, Hungary is. Got so far to go if you... And that's their capital. Um, so, yeah, I would have a long, long way to go. And I am going to take... Uh, attack them now. This would be my my invasion. Into uh, central Europe. There you go. Occupy it. And we move on. And I can just move this guy into here. Because that's going to rebel. Then Stradetz has got like loads of free slots here, and none of them can be a mosque, because we've already done that. We can put a plaza in though. We can put in a town barracks, and we can put in... What else? What's short on here? We're actually okay on food, but I'm going to put in a field, because I'm sure we will run out of that soon or, or later. Uh, Nis, you just need to... I mean, City Gate House is pretty sore. Don't want a blacksmith. Don't need your, two, uh, your level 2 stuff. Silver mine. No, don't really need that. Even though that's pretty useful. Hmm. I'm going to leave it for now, actually. I'll leave the silver mine. And then I'm going to... Though it's, it has so many debuffs, that's the only issue. Squalor plus... Three. Yeah, no, actually, I would rather get rid of that. Um, and then... City Gate House. Can I convert that into anything? Engineer Workshop. Can't really convert... Can't convert it into any of these. Um, like an Amir's Barracks would be very useful. But that's a long, long way down, like all the way over here. Uh, so I am going to, I'm going to just destroy it for now, and then we can convert it into a level two garrison, possibly. And then I'm going to repair. Well, yeah, I'll repair that for now, and then I can convert that. At your command. And then, what can we do here? We'll put re uh, integrity and replenishment uh, two in. So then that's like, this army is just replenishing constantly. Uh, you need an upgrade as well. You can have, uh, go down here, get zeal, and then you can have integrity. So this army's just always got some integrity. You would carry on moving all the way over here, Sunny Jim. And where's Serbia's armies? Not not been seen yet, is the answer. Katasia can get a garrison. Yeah, all these places are slowly just starting to hate me again. That's fine, we we'll put some Ghazi in and you can have some some more of these guys and have some tier. Have some, have some just level light shot cavalry. I don't even know what I was going to describe them as. That's just how much I like care about that cavalry. Um, yeah, you're upgrading. Great. Um, yeah, not really much else I would want to, to do really. I mean, obviously I could like continue my invasion. I think Bulgaria is in the war, so I mean Bulgaria would love... Probably to expand, yeah, they, they're at war with Serbia, so they come in. Actually, no, yeah, they could only attack Serbia there. They'd have to go that way then. They guess, I, yeah, they could have a big war out there. Yeah, that's possible. It'd be a, quite a big war, this one. Um, and then I could obviously, like, take out Hungary. So I would take out Serbia, Hungary, go into Venice, into their heartlands here. Um, I don't know why that, like, crosses over the border. I've just seen that. Ooh, that's a bit... 
I don't know. I feel, feel like that. Um, so yeah, that like that's how it's going at the moment. I'm actually on very good terms with quite a lot of people in in uh, in the West just because of trade. Um, but yeah, that's that. That's be how it, that would be how it will go now. The Seljuk Empire, as you can see, they're number one in the world. Uh, our Imperium is impressive. I think I've been on the same guy the entire way through this game. He is literally at age 64 now. He's literally hanging on for. But we are untrustworthy apparently. Um, I don't. I'm not surprised. We've broken a lot of uh, trade agreements and stuff like that. I would probably take out Nice here at some point, but I would never get out of trust on un being untrustworthy then. Um, but yeah, so we are. We are untrustworthy with the rest of the world. But a lot of people still like us. Um, only people that I care about. So yeah, we would probably go westwards now and probably take on the rest. That'd be like the Ottomans, basically. We'd be going for uh, going for Vienna, basically, at this point. Trying to take that. But uh, yeah, that is where we're going to wrap up this campaign, I feel. Um, we kind of got to the end of what I wanted to do, just make a campaign from it. We're kind of just snowballing at this point. And there's no real challenge left to... Uh, to f for us to face really we'd have to face like maybe like a huge crusade or something like that would that would be what it would come down to and i don't think that's going to be happening anytime soon so yeah if you've enjoyed this campaign like i said do remember to leave a like subscribe from your own here and a comment to show you support and uh yeah there will be another let's play coming soon i'm just like thinking of some ideas and like maybe some different mods to try out um but yeah i will see you guys in the next one bye for now